Hi everyone and welcome back to a brand new video on my channel. As you can see today I'm back with a brand new video on Clash Royale and today what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be upgrading my final two cards in my deck to level 14 so all of my cards will be level 14 and yeah all I'll need to do then is get them to level 15 but obviously I need the elite wild cards for that and the only cards I have got to level 14 is the ones in my deck gonna have to work on trying to get more of them and slowly start to max out my deck but this is like the closest I've come to maxing out in a long time so yeah let's just get straight into it and upgrade them both I have got quite a lot of gold at the moment nice I get some extra elite wild cards I think with them what I'll probably do I'll just wait until um, I'll just wait until I've got enough to actually do one of them but I'll probably use the gold on something else also got a level up nice see what I get be nice if I could get one of the things and get some elite wild cards oh nice got some there it's good to see okay that's all good and yeah so completely level 14 deck I'm still in arena 16 I haven't played the game in so long I generally don't even know what it's going to be like, but yeah, let's just get straight into the game and see how we get on. It has been a while. Let's see what they're like. Okay, they're probably playing that deck then. I always find my deck always seems to do fairly well against um against decks like this. I actually don't know what that tower is. Again, I haven't really played the game like at all, so generally that tower is like, huh? I'm looking at it like, what the hell is that? Yeah, generally my deck has enough like random stuff in it that can deal sort of splash damage that. Honestly, I'm just happy to keep countering the princess like that. Just gonna play this Sparky down as well. And that Tesla would have pretty much been fully used up by then. The entire thing's just gone. Yeah, they're in trouble. the level of the sparky as well like i think this is the problem with the arena i'm in because i haven't played it in so long it just means that my levels are just that much higher than everyone else that they just can't handle them and you know, i'm not doing it deliberately generally i just haven't played the game but i could easily get up to a super high arena if i wanted to i could probably get back up to the um the sort of champions arena type of thing i think it's what it's called i can't really remember but yeah, just been not playing the game, so happy to take this. Just don't want them to take that tower and try and get the uh, full, full crowns. And yeah, there we are. All three. Because <clears throat> I know that's what I think someone said in the last one. You know, as I was saying about winning, but it was because of the levels. And yeah, I 100% agree. It is definitely because of the levels, like... I may have a bit more problem if they had the same levels as me, but that just comes down to me actually playing the game. Like I feel like getting through this, I could probably do quite easily. I might maybe start struggling here, I don't really know. Honestly, it's not something I'm really going to do, I'm kind of just playing a couple games here. I mainly, like whenever I play this game, I mainly only play on the random deck series, just because I kind of enjoy that. You know, the whole thing, I'm just 
constantly like playing the game with the same deck just to um, just to try and uh, <clears throat> just try and get a bit higher. Just I find it really boring. I get bored. Nice, that should go onto that tower, get some decent damage on it. Yeah, and it just completely missed that. Nice. Honestly, I'm going to let my elixir build up a little bit. Generally, what what I find is, well, I don't use the Sparky, like, a lot. It works kind of well when I do use it, but it's not something I use a lot. Just sort of see whether they want to send something a certain way. Because that baby dragon will take the tower if they don't do something about it, so... Really good placement on the Valkyrie, and I cannot believe they just played them down, like... You just played that down on top of a Valkyrie. That can pretty much one-shot them, like, that's really not your smartest move. And that's going to be that tower gone as well. Honestly, their deck works all right. You know, if you only want to take one tower, generally I find. But, you know, one tower is not going to cut it. Not in this uh, game anyway. Just like that, the Sparky annihilates it. I kind of just put that down just to put them off. What the hell is a tower troop chest? Oh, what does it give you? The tower troop things, cannon. Air. Again, I don't really know what that is. Maybe I might have to play around with it at some point. You know, you got all of these ones. I generally don't really know what the difference is, but I think until I can get them up to a decent level, like, there's no real point. Like, generally, I'm just going to stick with the one I got for now, just because of the level. Like, the other ones is just... Like, the other ones, there's no way I'm going to be able to do anything with a level 6 one. Like, even if I upgrade it, I could probably upgrade it to, like, maybe, what, with that? eight or nine again still not really going to be able to do anything so yeah let's get into the final game and see how i get on i might even be able to get into the next arena as well potentially let's see what they play honestly i love the way some people as well just like wait to see what your opponents plays as well like i always find i just want to get it started I'm just going to play that down straight away and that should pretty much one shot them not quite one shot the prince but close enough honestly this guy is the same sort of thing to me he's obviously relying on his levels and he really misplayed that mega knight like completely wrong place And he's just panicking now, because if that Sparky touches, that tower's gone. Yeah, like the Mega Knight, he should have played it further back. Why is he defending that? That Sparky's literally going to take the tower on its own. <laughs> like, you don't want to worry about the side tower when the main tower's gone anyway. Honestly, that was so dumb. Like, he needed to stop that Sparky. 
And yeah, he probably would have had to sacrifice the tower, but... I don't actually know what these are, to be honest. Five wild cards, nice. Get another one of these. I'll take that. Am I actually close to the um, next arena as well? I am very, very close. So potentially I might do that for another video. And I also unlocked a Valkyrie one. Which one was this? I'm not even sure, to be honest. Level four now. Got some more gold. Not that I really need that. So the damage dealer one is on the final one. None of the other ones are really close. But... Yeah, what I'll probably do is I'll probably do another video where I try and get into Arena 17. But yeah, that's it for this deck. All level 14 cards. I mean, I pretty much mopped the floor with everyone just purely because of the levels, like especially the Sparky. It was just one shot in everything almost. The only thing really was that level 15 Prince where I didn't quite one shot it, but then that's like a max level Prince. Not really too surprising. And the Mega Knight as well, but it still dismantled that easily. So, yeah, I mean, it wasn't really too difficult. And I'm not going to say it's because I was skillful. It's just because my levels is that much higher. I need to really push up the push up the arenas a little bit. But I just can't really be bothered. So, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, leave a like, subscribe. And everything else you like to see on Clash Royale or any other games like see me do on this channel. And, yeah, I'll see you guys all in the next one. Built a empire of stars